Mm -hmm. I'm Jake Tapper with this breaking news. Jeff Zucker, chairman of Warner Media News and Sports and president of CNN Worldwide, will be receiving the Fred Dressler Leadership Award at the Newhouse Mayor Awards today in New York City before an audience of industry professionals. Growing up, I had a couple dreams. Here's what we know about Mr. Zucker. The first was that I would play center court at Wimbledon. Jeff has indefatigable energy. Always a man to be reckoned with. I wasn't quite good enough. One of his best skills. The next one was that I would play quarterback for the Miami Dolphins. Is the ability to not seem as short as he actually is. I wasn't quite big enough. The next one was that I would go to Harvard Law School. He is smart. We called him the whiz kid. All around very clever guy. I didn't get in. He's not just a producer at heart, he's a producer indeed. He'd grown up with television in a way that a lot of people had not. He is in the business that he was meant to be in. So I ended up in television. NBC News. I was incredibly lucky. I had the best jobs of my life when I was really young. And I so vividly remember my first day here. Jeff was a boy wonder from the moment he walked through the doors of NBC. As an Olympic researcher for NBC Sports. I met Jeff 25 years ago. From NBC News. And from there, I went straight to the Today Show. Today. When he was the youngest executive producer. He was only 26 years old. Jeff was so young that we began to call him Doogie Howser. I really feel like he's the heart and soul of the program. Go! One of the first moments I remember, Jeff gave me a chance to fill in for well. Meredith Vieira on the Today Show. All right, and that's a, a really great question. He gave me my job at the Today Show as national correspondent. Jamie, good morning. And I think Jeff was willing to take risk and almost remove the veneer of the TV screen from viewers. He had this great optimism. Well, he was viewed by his peers as the new generation of television producers. About NBC. The responsibility to lead this great company is awe-inspiring. About our ability to lead. You know, NBC News continues to be one of the great symbols of this entire company. About our ability to create a great voice around the world. What was important in the news and how to present it in a way that the country would care about it. At the ripe old age of 28, our executive producer, Jeff Zucker, has decided that he's Tally. ready for a primetime player. He's moving on. Eight, four, three. Look out, Hollywood. Two. Here comes Zucker. It's a 24-7 business. He runs CNN the way he ran the Today Show. Jeff at CNN is not only 24-7, but it's worldwide. He doesn't sleep. I think one of the things that I've always been proud of is that I've always been willing to be the last person in the control room. And he has the kind of energy, if you will. And he works his ass off. Jeff has a combination of energy, intensity. And the system in which he can adapt to it very quickly. Being agile and being willing to move, willing to take chances, understand that not everything we're going to try is going to work. He's always bubbling with new ideas, eager to get on with it. He has a vision. He articulates it. He talks to a lot of people. I think those things make Jeff very special. His ability to have those conversations and those moments with a lot of different people. What I admire most about Jeff is completely changed CNN. Jeff does not hesitate to give people chances and to take risks. He brought in different people. It's truly an honor to join the CNN team. The only reason I came back to work was because of Jeff. Special correspondent Jamie Gangel. A collective conscience. CNN's Don Lemon. Jeff took that chance on me. It worked out. I succeeded. He was an inspired leader that really drove people to bring their best. And I think he cares very much about not only succeeding, but succeeding with everybody together. Obviously, I am a journalist, and I will always be grateful to him for doing that. I said to him one time, you know, you are the only boss I've ever had who is ballsier than I am. And I meant it. I've had so many great moments and milestones in my career. Zucker is one of the most talented producers I've ever been around. Running the Today Show. Jeff really is the whole package. Running NBC Entertainment. He's a strong leader, he's smart, he's not afraid to make decisions. Being given the opportunity to run all of NBC Universal. He just constantly wants to know more, 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 more. Starting Hulu. Jeff Zucker is the guy. I think what I'm proudest of today is what we've been able to do at CNN. He knows the subject matter and he's passionate. And to make sure that the world is informed and that people know that Whoa. <laughs> there's someone holding those in power accountable. Fred Dressler, who happened to have been a journalist, one of my great friends, and this is a big moment for me because Fred was one of my best friends, and Jeff is my best friend today. For Jeff to get this award 
is a huge deal for me personally. Jeff, congratulations. This is a very distinguished award from a great university, Syracuse. So congratulations, Jeff. Jeff, congratulations. Congratulations on the award. Congratulations on this. Well-deserved honor as you continue to accomplish so many great things. All the best to you. Congratulations. Let's get after it. Peace. Thank you all very much.